channel and today I want to share with you guys a haul video and it is this box that I got from Wet n Wild. It has a bunch of goodies inside. Um, I already dropped this box twice in this video trying to film it. Of Wet n Wild goodies. Oh my god. I loved it. Ah! So I'm going to try not to drop it again this time. My voice is finally cooperating and I sound a little bit more normal. I don't sound like I'm dying. So I was like, I'm just going to sit down and talk to you guys because I miss like talking to you guys. I forgot what was in here, so we're going to find out together. Um, there are some things that I already picked through and already used, and I'm going to share that with you guys. But um, for the most part, I really kind of forgot what I got. So um, the first thing that I see here are eyelashes, and I don't think Wet n Wild has had eyelashes before. At least I haven't seen them. Um, they have all different kinds. There's like the shredding. What is it called? shredding the fringe um, this one looks crazy it's volume vortex and it just has like really crazy full eyelashes um, and I think I would probably wear these like a photo shoot or like on a video but I don't think I'd wear these on a daily basis just because I don't want them to look super fake I'm not into super fake eyelashes I want them to look as natural as possible um, this one is called natural sink which I would probably wear most often and then we have these it's called max band width and they're just super long and and curly which I really like and then the ones that I will probably wear um, soon are called Shutter Shock and these are the ones that I would probably um, go out and buy more often um, just because they look really pretty and like wispy okay. the reason why I really started getting to eyelashes now is because of my friends online shop and her name is Stephanie she's here on YouTube and she's also on Instagram she has the most beautiful pictures you guys have to check her out I'll have a, her links down below but she opened her her own shop online and she has like makeup brushes which are absolutely gorgeous and the ones that I'm wearing right now are actually from her um, shop and then there's these two they're so pretty and natural and I've been getting so many compliments on them and they look very like natural they don't look like they're super fake which is something that I like and they're made out of mink so you guys should check her out and that's why I got those eyelashes because I've really been getting into them lately been getting been getting this on a funny right been getting into them okay so I, the next thing that I see in here are foundation brushes what is this? a powder brush an eyeshadow brush and a foundation brush and I didn't know Wet n Wild had these um, I've had their eyeshadow brushes before they were limited edition but I'm super excited about these now um, just because they look like they're really good quality I love the eyeshadow brushes that I had before do I have them at hand okay so I got this mascara simply because of the packaging it's pink I can't help it that's just how my brain works when it sees something pretty I'm like oh it's pretty I don't know if it works or not but I'm going to try it out um this I really like just because it's um 360 pumped up lashes that's what it's called and um oh it says new so it is a new mascara and it has like a small thin wand and then has like a thicker wand one for the top lashes and one from the bottom or for the bottom and I'm really excited to try this out so especially because it's pink, you know. Um, the next thing that I see in here are blushes. And I actually, I actually already used one. Sorry, I can't talk today. My nose is not cooperating at the moment. And it's hard for me to um, talk. So, because I'm trying to breathe through my mouth at the same time. And Okay, that was probably like TMI. But, okay, so the next... <gasps> it broke. And this makes me so sad. I didn't even get a chance to try this one out. I feel like this one I would wear on a daily basis and it sucks. That was probably my favorite one um, that I got. This one is called, let's see, these are from the Wet n Wild uh, Fergie collection, the center stage collection. And this one is called Brush with Destiny, which is probably the prettiest one out of the bunch. And I just broke it, which sucks. And then we have, um, this is called... What is it called? Brush with Brilliance and I've already tried this one. It's absolutely stunning. It's very pretty and just the color payoff is amazing. If you guys have ever tried any of like Wet n Wild eyeshadows or blushes, they are amazing. Um, the color payoff is so great and the price is just, you can't beat the price. Um, this one is called, let's see, Brush with Danger and it's just a really pretty pinky one which I will probably just dust on my cheeks in the summertime because it's so bright when I'm tan. Um, right now I don't think it'll look very nice on my skin tone. Um, but um, I really like this one a lot too. I'm just so sad about that blush. It sucks. It sucks, you know? Um, the next thing that I want to share with you guys is this eyeshadow palette which I already opened and I actually have on my eyes right now. Let me see. <gasps> What is my problem? Come on, Belinda, get it together. 
Fuller Payoff is amazing. It's really pretty. Like I said, I've already used it. I tried it on my eyes. If you guys are looking for an affordable palette that has like all neutral shades, definitely pick this one up. I'm pretty sure it's super cheap, just like all of Wet n Wild's products when it comes to price. But when it comes to quality, um, you cannot beat that. It's amazing. It's really pretty. Um, I also got this. It's called the Wet n Wild Overall Correcting Palette. And I have swatches on my hands from earlier. Um, but over here, um, this is like different, different almost concealers. It's not really a concealer, but you apply this underneath your foundation. Um, depending if you have like a pimple, if you have redness, if you have dark circles, you want to use like different kinds of shades just to correct the problem. And this is perfect for that. Um, it doesn't matter how long you've been doing makeup. I feel like every single girl who applies even lip gloss needs something like this in her makeup collection just because you never know where you're going to get a pimple or a blemish that you want to cover up and this will help with that as well and I know it's weird because it's like purple and green but it just depends what you're trying to cover up. Uh, I also needed something for my brows as you guys could see like um, my brows have been crazy lately and I need a little help with them so I got the brushes because I don't know what shade I was. I'm like I have no idea what color of eyebrow I am because my hair is naturally black as you, as you guys can see I have like a chocolatey what would you call this chocolate brown I grabbed three different eye pencils and I like that it has like the spoolie at the end and it has like um, the pencil right here so I could just make them look nice and even oh this is another one that I grabbed uh, they came out with they are like lip crayons lip pencils whatever you want to call them the formula is ridiculously amazing it's like NARS it's like Smashbox it is so velvety and soft on your lips it doesn't dry them out it has the appeal of a matte lipstick but it's very moisturizing and it stays on all day long it's very long lasting I already used it I couldn't wait as soon as I saw the packaging I opened up three and I am wearing this one on my lips right now it is called velvet the velvet crayon that's what it's called it's called fashion darling ooh fashion darling it's called fashion darling if you guys go to belindasling.com I'll probably swatch all of them on my lips on my blog so you guys can see like which shade you should go out and get um, because they're absolutely amazing you have to have to get one if you guys run across and then I also got a bunch of their new um, nail polishes and I'm a nail polish freak the one that I'm most excited about that I don't have something like this in my collection is this one it's called let's try it it's called black cream black cream it's not black it's blue okay so it's called yep yeah, black cream that's the name of it but look how beautiful that blue is and I'm super excited about it I don't have anything like that in my collection this is a really pretty like just neutral everyday classic shade this one is called Yo Soy oh no way is it in Spanish is it supposed to be in Spanish Yo Soy Yo Soy so love these two and then I grabbed all of these shades that are new so I am super excited give this video a thumbs up if you guys want to continue to see like hauls like this um, from Wet n Wild because I am a Wet n Wild beauty ambassador and I get these goodies to share with you guys um, it's not mandatory but I love to share them with you guys anyway and um, don't forget to subscribe and I will talk to you guys in my next video muchas besos Mwah. have you ever looked at a picture of a room or a space and said to yourself, that is so Tumblr. Well, now your friends can say that about your room too. I'm gonna share with you guys little tips and tricks on how to make an office space be more enjoyable, not only for function, but also a place where you love to be.